Good morning, everybody. So today, we're going to go to the book of Matthew. And you might be wondering why I'm wearing a, uh, a vest. And uh, you, sometimes you see construction workers wear these. Uh, you see sometimes um, people with the stop signs next to schools holding these or wearing these. Sometimes police officers or uh, construction workers or um, people driving vehicles. They wear something kind of bright, something that has kind of reflections. Um, and the reason is because they need to be seen. Um, and a lot of times it's because they're in either dangerous situations or in positions where it's good to be able to see them. Now, I'm inside, so I don't really need this, but we're going to read from Matthew and see and talk about why. You are the light of the world. A city set on a hill cannot be hidden, nor do people light a lamp and put it underneath a basket, but put it on a stand and it gives light to the whole house. So you're kind of wondering why I have a vest, but we read from Matthew that we are a light of the world. We shine God's light to the entire world because we're Christian. And in being Christian, we represent Christ. We represent God. And what we should do is reflect God's light and God's love and God's forgiveness to the people that we interact with. But also, we're a city on a hill. We should be seen we should be known for what we do. And that's the amazing gift God gives us. His love, his grace, and forgiveness. Not things that we've earned, not that we've lived a perfect life, but that God gives it as a gift. And we can give that to other people. Can you pray with me? Dear Jesus, we thank you so much for living a perfect life. Help us to always reflect your love, your grace, and your forgiveness to those that we uh, come into contact with each day. Help us to love even when it's hard. Help us to forgive even when it's difficult. And always help us remind, always remind us that you are here with us through it all. Thank you so much. All this we ask in your name we pray. Amen. Blessings.